welcome back to my channel and today you guys have already read the title of this video it is gonna be my skincare routine before we start i just want to say number one yes my hair is now like almost black and second yes my shirt is crumpled and i cannot be bothered and third everybody's skin is different but these are the products that work best for me this this is honestly what i use every day and um I just want to also say that I have not been into skincare um, like last year. I only got into it this year because I went to my first ever facial this year and I realized that my skin could have been better than it was. So that's why I got a little bit more serious into skincare and started, you know, moisturizing and toning. Like before this, all I did was just wash my face, that's it. Um, and I would like apply serum when I'm feeling a little fancy but now I noticed that it is really important to tone your face it is really important to moisturize and all that jazz so this is my skincare routine without further ado let's just you know talk about the products and stuff so first and foremost what I use as a facial cleanser is my charcoal bars so this one i got from the body shop this is like my third bar before this was really hard to get but now they have it in stores in malaysia it's only 28 ringgit and um you can try it out dude it's just literally like a charcoal bar and if you buy this you save the red pandas dude so it's pretty good and um how i use this is just i take the bar and i put it under water and i just rub it in my hand and literally fo like foam will form and you just that's what that's what i do so how i store the charcoal bar is um i just put it on my sink just like that but if you are more like of a hygienic person like i would recommend you do this then instead just put it out there like me um you can just grab a plastic container get like a sponge and every time you use it, just put it on the sponge so all the water will drip onto the sponge and you just clean the sponge every now and then so if you want to store it that way, that will be better yeah, so I love using this on my face because I feel like it really helps like minimizing my pores and really like getting everything off because you know, um, it's really different from uh, really the phone has to ring now Anyway, yeah, the charcoal bar is really good. Um, I mean, if you want to try it out, just try it. It's not really a big deal because the ingredients are all very like organic and stuff, so it's good for you. There's no chemicals or whatever, and um, so there's a really big difference between um, facial cleanser that is like when you squeeze it out, then like a bar bar. So I suggest you guys try a bar one out if you guys have not tried it before. So anyway, uh, this is my second bar. That's how much I like it. You can even use this on your back knee and stuff like that. So yeah. Moving on, I want to show you guys what I use for toner. Yes, toner. So um, I watched this video on Twitter. I don't remember like how it went, but there was this girl. She took like roses and like like all these ingredients and she made like this water bottle spray thing with rose water and um, it seems so legit so I really like ever since I saw that video I don't know why I really like rose water stuff so my toners are both rose water toners um, the first one is the rose water toner from Lush this is the big one um, can you help get this for me in Japan so this one is when I'm like super lazy, I just like psh, psh. This is when like, I'm really sleepy and I cannot bother to get a cotton pad or whatever Or when I'm in a rush in the morning, so I just spritz this And it feels really fresh and lovely And I also have the fresh, rot the fresh rose water toner, it is the deep hydration facial toner from Fresh Yes See, it's almost done. Um, when I first got this, I realized that the price is like pretty expensive. I don't remember the price now, but like, it's pretty expensive, ah, like for if you want to 
if I want to recommend it to you, I don't I don't know if I should recommend it to you because it's quite pricey. But um, over time, I got to love it. So I don't know. I don't know. I I, I don't know if you guys should try it or not. But I kind of like it. Um, yeah, as you can see, it's almost done. I bought this like two months ago. I think two or three months ago. And um, yes, it removes impurities and like just softens your face and I just love the rose water kind of like feel and smell to it because I don't know I, I saw somewhere that rose water makes you look or feel younger or whatever so yeah love rose water toners keeps you fresh and young and stuff so moving on moisturizers um, I use this one this is the simple skin to kind to skin Moisturizer, hydrating light moisturizer. It's 12 hours moisturization. This one, when they say light, it is really light, okay? Like, um, I'm not the type of person that likes to like slather. I have a friend who likes to slather moisturizer like literally like all over her face before she sleeps. So she looks like super oily before she sleeps. But like, I'm not about that life. I don't really like deep moisturization like I don't like the feeling on my skin I like something that's light that just like it works and it doesn't feel like it's there I, I don't I don't like to wear heavy stuff I like to wear very light light stuff so I like this one because it feels really light it just like when you put it on and it just feels like skin so this is fun this is great B5 vitamin E yes yeah I don't know much about moisturizers, so I just use this one. I also have the Mary Kay Time Wine Age Fighting Moisturizer. I like to use this on my neck because my neck, I have like lines on my neck. Um, and it's really annoying, so I use this to like, you know, smoothen it and stuff. Like, because um, one of the few signs that show you aging is your hands and your neck. One of them, yeah, so. Um, Gotta moisturize the neck. Do not neglect the neck. The neck? The neck. Yeah, later you, your face looks like, oh my god, you look like 15 years old, but then your neck is sagging on the floor, so like, yeah. Oh, by the way, I did not mention this earlier. I'm not wearing any makeup at all, so you guys can see. This is my skin. This is how it looks like. I have like this mark here. From, I had a pimple here and I did not take care of it and it's just scarred there for the past like three months so it's just there but besides that I don't really have much pimples or anything or whatever because because yeah that's just how it is um I also have oh my gosh I really want to show you guys this hold on I'm gonna look for a hair tie now that my hair is out of the way, I like to use this thing that you can just like pop on your hair like this so that your hair is not on your face. I like to sleep with this because I don't wash my hair every day. If you guys watch my hair care routine, I'll leave it in the description box down below if you guys want to watch my hair care routine. But um, I use this to sleep because I mentioned in my hair care routine that I do not... Um, I do not what? I do not um, wash my hair every day. But your hair is dirty tau. Like, you know, when you go lepa and you sweat and stuff, so much um, the dirt goes to your face and you. So, let's just move on. I want to show you guys this. I have no idea where to get this. If you know where to get this, please leave in the comments so other people can buy it. But my sister got this. She gave it to me and it's the Joseristine, really long name by the way, it is an exfoliator. So I do not recommend you guys use this every day, but if you want to use it, I mean not every day, uh, like maybe three times a week. Um, I like to use this on the days where I use a lot of makeup, like a lot, a lot, a lot. So this is how you use it. First you wet your face. I'm going to do this part on my face just to show you guys what it does. Okay, so I'm just gonna pump a little bit on my hand. Okay, that's not really a little bit. I mean, I always put more than I should anyway. And then I'm just gonna rub this in circular motions. 
and around my nose and stuff like that and you can see like your dead skin cells forming there you can see that your dead skin cells are like forming and when i go to the gym i mean i don't really gym but like there was that one time i went to the gym and i washed my face afterwards and all of this white stuff is like gray so it's like nasty but you know it gets it off um and sometimes if i wear really heavy makeup these little things are like my foundation color so you really don't know that if you have you take everything off even if i wash my face with the facial cleanser it's still there so i like to use this to really get it off it's an exfoliator that's not that harsh on your skin but but it really gets it off you know you want, i'm just gonna get closer you guys can see Ooh, that's nasty I would say this product is super drying because every time I use this product like around my here, this area, I don't know what area is that called it gets like really good tight it gets like really tight and stuff so I always have to put on a lot of moisturizer oh yeah, I also use one more moisturizer by Lush it is called the um what is it called? the vanishing cream I use that also from Lush um, that's one of my favorite, but I just finished it, so um, yeah. And so Lush should open like fast in Malaysia. So I like how this feels afterwards. Like this is like baby skin. So. I have no idea where you guys can get this, but I really like this. So this is not like. A product to use on your skin but it will help your skin I have this Sephora spray that you just spray on your brush like this let me show you like this so then you just wave it around and it kills the bacteria on your brush and you don't have to wash your brush if you're in a rush like me all the time so that it cleans your brush just let it dry for a bit cleans your brush without like putting more bacteria on your face so that helps with your skin i guess um and it's really important to wash your brushes guys like i feel like one of my main problems like when i have acne is not because of my genetics like my mom doesn't have like acne my dad doesn't really have acne so like it's all because of like hygiene, like makeup brushes and change your bed sheets and drink a lot of water, like legit drink a lot of water. Like before I sleep, I always have like a water bottle at my bedside table and I just try to finish it like just one whole bottle right before I sleep or I would just get a glass and like drink like three glasses of water in, in the morning so Yes, like just force yourself to drink water. I mean like, you won't get anything bad from it. Besides, you have to go to the toilet a lot. Like, it's so worth it for your skin and for your health and to cleanse out your body and your toxins and stuff like that. So, I think that's about it. Oh, face masks. I don't have any face masks with me right now because um, I'm staying at my sister's house and um, I did not bring any face masks but I recommend you guys try the Body Shop Himalayan Charcoal face mask when I first used that face mask my face started to burn but like in a good way like like I feel like it actually because it's supposed to the charcoal is supposed to like um, deep, deep cleanse in your pores like it's supposed to like go really deep inside and you can actually like feel it because when i first used it it like hurt but like in a satisfying way like you know that it's all coming out and then when i like rinse my face it feels like really good and you can actually like see that your pores are minimized and stuff like that so that's what i use as a face mask and i'm almost done with that so i have to get a new one yes but i like that one a lot and I also use the Lush Magnum Minty 
which a lot of people use as well but I prefer the body shop one um that's about it I guess um I wish I had like tried out spot acne treatments like tea tree oil or something um but I have not gotten around to try that yet and yeah so when I do I'll do an updated skincare routine because I'm not really good with like the acne stuff but um, I also want to um, tell you guys that I use the bio oil that little orange bottle thing I don't have it with me right now but yeah that uh, yeah that orange bottle thing that is actually for stretch marks for people for girls for women who are pregnant and want to get rid of their stretch marks they use their bio oil and they put it on their belly so that their stretch marks will slowly fade disappear in time okay i'm gonna say in time because it takes a long while so i have a chicken pock chicken park chicken chicken pop chicken pock mark here wait where is it here it used to be super yeah i think you see it it used to be like super visible but now it's like not as visible because i use that so if you guys have like scars on your face like one i had here and this I like to use that there and there and you won't get the results like in a week or whatever but it works okay it's meant for stretch marks but you know I use it for my face and it works so um <coughs> this is not a skincare routine but it has to do with your face I really like the benefit bravo conditioning primer I use this on my brows because I tried to grow out my brows I just recently like like got them done so um, when I wanted to grow my brows out like make my hair grow longer and stuff I use this like every day and my hair my eyebrows got really really bushy so yeah you can also use castor oil for your brows and your lashes oh if you guys want to know what makeup remover I use, I use the Biore. Is that how you pronounce it? This one. I really like this one. So it's really easy. Just wipe it off. And um, yeah. So I really hope you guys like this video. If you like this video or find it helpful in any way, give this video a big thumbs up. And also um, comment down below on what products you think I should try or like underrated products that you want to share with any of my other subscribers here and if you have not subscribed to my channel you guys can subscribe also the button down below and yeah also recommend me what other videos you guys would like to see down in this, the comment box section down below if you guys got that then great but yeah 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 I don't know what else to say. We're gonna be alright. Thanks for watching my video, guys. Bye, I love you.